Greetings, everybody! T. Prar once again. Looks like we're in for some sports this time around. I might not be the biggest sports fan, but this still ought to be good. Without further ado, let's jump right into Season 6, Episode 18, Buckball Season. Let's get to it! Hey there, AJ. What you up to? Whoa, Dashy! Well, I was practicing my distance booking. So that's what the target's for. What for? Because Cousin Brayburn and the rest of the Apple family in Appaloosa seem to think that their team can beat Ponyville at Buckball. Ooh, sounds like a challenge. Whoa! Bullseye! That's ridiculous! No pony beats Ponyville! I mean, I could beat the whole town of Appaloosa at Buckball with one wing tied behind my back! You would say that, Dash. Holy crap! Nice teamwork, girls! Oh yeah, I am so there! I just got one question! Uh, what's Buckball? I don't know either, but I'm guessing we're about to find out. So hey, Pinks, Flutters. Buckball is the coolest game ever. Offense, defense, teamwork, non-stop action. Squishy cheeks. <laughs> well, Rainbow Dash, you sure seem to know a lot about this game. I've never even heard of Buckball. Neither have I, yeah, sweetie. I'm kind of an expert. An expert who hadn't heard of the game either until I told you. Well, <laughs> True. It's a new game. I probably know more than most ponies, so that makes me an expert. Good I don't grief. know anything about it at all, but it sounds like there's a ball and buggy, so I'm betting it's super duper fun. Anything's Boy, fun for my you, Pinky. Rayburn somehow convinced a Pegasus and a unicorn to come play with him on the Appaloosa team, and he can't stop bragging about how his team is gonna beat ours. Man, but, Brayburn's um, got guts challenging we you. Well, between Applejack and me, we've got two-thirds of a team. All we need is a unicorn. That's where you two come in. Huh? Uh, they know we're not unicorns, right? Well, of course. Uh, She's not stupid. You're gonna be on my team, and Fluttershy is gonna be on Applejack's team. We'll play against each other, along with whatever unicorns want to try out, until we find the best one. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Phew. That's a relief because I left my unicorn costume at home. Of course you did, Pinks. <laughs> nice do, Pinky. You here because I told you what an amazing game Buckball is. And even though it's already an Apple family favorite, most of you probably don't know anything about it. So I thought we'd give you a quick demonstration. Oh, so it's like basketball. The two Earth ponies are on offense. They meet in the middle of the field for the buck off. They both try to be the first one to kick it. Okay. Ooh, nice block. The Pegasus is on defense. She tries to keep the ball from going in the goal and passes it back to the Earth Pony on her team. Just okay, get it okay. Over the kick, Pinky. It's okay, oh, Flutters. I was never that good at ball sports and all either. All unicorns have to do is float these here baskets around the outside of the field and catch as many balls as possible for their team. Hmm. You two get Alrighty. Absolutely. Oh, I don't know. That ball moves pretty fast. I know the feeling, right. Pumpkin. Trust well, let's me. See which of you has what it takes. Um. What do I do? When the ball comes towards you, catch it. Simple as that. Play ball! Just try your best, Pinky. I have been doing this a lot longer than you. Whoa! <laughs> Holy! Flutters, that was amazing! Hey, watch it, Dash! Whoops. Hey! This game is easy! Ooh, it actually is kind of fun. 
Aww. Where did Pinkie Pie the book like that? And Fluttershy's spinning tail catch is pretty amazing. Those two are naturals. Okay. Well, let's see what the rest of you can do. Well, let's keep this thing going. Now, don't expect to be able to beat me twice in a row. She's gonna. Well, hello there, Mr. Ball. Ha <laughs> ha! Keep going, Flutters. Do it, Pinky. Hurry along, butterflies, before that ball comes and hits you. Uh oh. Nope. Come on, get Rarity in there. Okay. She's plenty tough. Let's see what the rest of you can do. Ow. Definitely not. Whoopsie. Whoa. Not a chance. Good lord. No. Nope. And no. This is not going well. This didn't go how I thought it would. <laughs> well, sure pinks and flutters are having fun. A lot of fun. Oh, hey there, snails. Snails, look out! Whoa! Whoa! How'd you do that? You should be more careful with these. You could lose them. Wow. Hey, snails, can you float one of those baskets over here? Hmm, sure. What do you want me to do with it? Catch! Hey, hey, not bad. Wow, snails, you're a natural at buck ball. It's a good thing, too. We were running out of unicorns. You've got some skill, kid. Applejack and Rainbow Dash against the Appaloosa team? I guess I'll find out. Plus, after I deliver this water, I don't really have anything else to do. Well, Snails, with you on the team, Ponyville is one step closer to crushing Appaloosa. <laughs> and after today, it's pretty clear who the other two players should be. Pinky and Fluttershy. What do you mean? I thought you and Dash were gonna play. Yeah, if you're not crushing Appaloosa, who is? <laughs> uh, you two, obviously. Obviously? Oh, don't look so surprised. You two are amazing. Um, you want us to play buckball against Appaloosa instead of you? You can do it. I believe in you. Incredible. Uh, you mean incredible, incredible right? And incredible. Come on. Oh. It, Only you, you two Pinky. Are really good at this game. And if it means beating Appaloosa, I'll give either one of you my spot on the team quicker than Granny Smith can core an apple. And how too. fast is that? I'd normally be so pumped all of Ponyville was counting on me to win, I'd run right over the competition. But you still flew rings around me. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just having fun. Well, Aw, sweetie, the that's the point. Want, to have well, fun. Beating the hide off of Braybird's team. I do like fun. Honestly, the game was a little scary at first, but once I got the hang of it, I had a pretty good time. That's the spirit! <laughs> Go, Pinky! Really Go, Pinky! Pelosa, we're gonna have to get serious. Uh-oh. Serious? Serious! <laughs> <laughs> that hoof on hip pose. With serious practice. Oh, dear. Oh, wow, this looks pretty intense. Well, duh! You two are gonna be representing all of Ponyville, and more importantly, us. I That's don't think this is gonna bode well. Lucy, tomorrow, you two are gonna practice just as hard as we would. So let's hop to it. Snails already has a head start on you. He's good. Okay, if you wanna win, you totally gotta get this drill down. I, I, I do. Stay calm, darling. Man, look at her go. Very impressive, Dash. Ready? You can do it. Come on, faster! You don't want Ponyville to lose because he can't 
can't get into high gear, do you? Oh, jeez. Huh, <laughs> show off. Poor All flutters. Right. Being able to buck a ball into a goal from any direction is the most important thing in the game. If you say so. Two points. <laughs> That's adorable. Good shot. Whoop, butt bounce. Looks like Pinky's got this down. Uh-oh, you shouldn't have said that, AJ. Since when did you get so good at magic, snails? Ouch. Come on now. Every shot is for sweet apple acres. And me, and Dash, and all of Ponyville. Lay off the pressure, will ya? Faster. No. Come on now. Come on. Just let them go back to having fun. This is just painful. What in the apple happened to those two? I don't know. They mopped the field with us before. Before you started pressuring them. All right. That's it for today, y'all. Yeah. I thought practice was supposed to make us better. Maybe we just need a little rest. It's not or your a fault. A lot of it. Just be sure to get your heads in the game before tomorrow. All of Ponyville is counting on a win. Enough with the pressure! It's making things worse! You really don't want to let Applejack and Rainbow Dash down, or any pony else, but after that practice, I'm not feeling very confident. Oh, Maybe sweetie. Not that bad. Uh, I guess I was hoping you saw something I didn't. Oh, I know Pinky. our friends want us to win, but. How can the whole town be counting on us if most ponies have never even heard of Buckball? I know! How can we disappoint a pony who doesn't even know we have a team? Or that we're gonna play Appaloosa? Good point. Yeah, I don't think we need to worry. I'd be surprised if any pony in this town cares about this game at all. Oh, you shouldn't say that, Pinks. Go! Derpy! Go! Hey, Lyra! The whole town really seems to care about this game a lot. See what happens when you tempt fate? Well, good luck. <laughs> we kind of went around town and talked up the team a little. A yep. little? We wanted to make sure you two knew that all of Ponyville was behind you. Oh, they really needed that. Thanks. I hear the whole town's already planning a parade for when you get back after whooping Appaloosa. That should feel pretty good. A little presumptuous, aren't we? Totally! Just spend the whole ride to Appaloosa thinking about every pony cheering for the victorious Ponyville Buckball team. Why, that Princess Celestia even comes to congratulate you! If that doesn't get you in the zone, I don't know what will. Which zone? The freakout zone? I don't know what zone Rainbow Dash is talking about, but I'm pretty sure I don't want to be in it. Do you? I don't blame you. Hey! You two are supposed to be in the zone! Oh, shut up! Good lord, Flutters! I'm glad you got that off your chest, but holy crap, Baskets! All those faces you were making! I don't know whether to be proud or terrified! <laughs> See what you two did? I'm still okay with playing in case you were worried. Oh, we know, Snails. Don't worry. I don't get it! They're naturals! Why wouldn't they want to play anymore? 
telling them how much every pony was counting on them messed them up somehow. Exactly. What? That's crazy talk. Having ponies depend on you is exactly what you need to focus. And serious and play hard and get ready to totally smash the competition and... And none of that sounds like Pinky or Fluttershy, does it? No, it sounds like you two. It's not. We got so wrapped up in what's important to us, we went and ruined what was fun about the game for them. Mm, what do we do now? Uh, apologize? Pinky? Fluttershy? They hid in here? here? Well, we've looked in every other car on the train. Maybe you need to look again. Yeah, because we're totally not in here. Oh, I totally believe that. If you're gonna try and make us play against that blue star. Or any pony else! <clears throat> now, now, calm down, girls. We're sorry to let you down, but it's better to do it now than during the game against Appaloosa. You don't have to play against Appaloosa. We don't? Nope. We're gonna take your place. So you don't have to worry about that at all. Good! <sighs> Why didn't you say so? But we can't take on Brayburn and his team without any practice. So we need you to play just one more time against us. Oh? Now, I know we mixed up the teams before, but since Dash and I really need the practice, we'll play against the two of you. Okay, then. much practice you'll get against us. We've been playing just awful. Don't worry about it. Applejack and I just need a little workout. Yep. You two just do your best. And have fun. Play ball! Come on, girls. You can do it. There you go! Now you've got it! Looks like you two really do need practice. Oh ho ho! Sick burn flutters! Now this is more like it! You're all doing really well. Ha! <laughs> he hasn't had much to do. Man, you two look if a you wreck. Can practice, we can keep going. Yeah, I can do this all day. Glad to see you two having no fun thanks. again. Playing against you two is just as humiliating now as it was when we trying to show you how awesome you are. Wait. What? Finally. <laughs> Good job, well, kiddo. How you aren't bad anymore. Oh yeah. Weird. But um why were we so terrible before? Because of the pressure. Some ponies thrive on pressure and some ponies don't. And even though we weren't playing, we were treating you like us, which totally stressed you out. Yep. And that just sucked the fun right out of the game for you. And having fun is what makes you really, really, really good. No denying but that. Being good doesn't matter if we're too afraid of letting ponies down. Yeah. What about all those ponies back in Ponyville counting on us to win? I'm sure folks want you to win, but not if worrying about it makes you miserable. Winning's never worth that. Well but said, AJ. How do we keep from worrying about it? You could do what I do and not think about it. Seriously, I don't think about anything. Ever. Heh. <laughs> we could learn a lot from you, snails. Alrighty! How you doing, Brayburn? Let's go, Ponyville! Not think? Not think about it? 
Yep. Yeah, that. <laughs> and as long as you're having fun, it doesn't matter if you win or not. I sure as heck won't think less of you. <laughs> oh, Pinky. You let that one go, Brayburn. Keep it up. Yes! Woohoo! That's my girls! Great job, everyone! <laughs> Looks like you three made quite an impression. I'll say. Well, cousin, I have to admit, your Ponyville team played a pretty good game. You're a good sport, Brayburn. Good game? We bucked the hooves right off of you. Yep, you sure as shooting did. I'm gonna have to get real serious about a strategy for our rematch. Uh oh. Oh, I wouldn't get too serious. Yeah. Everybody knows the secret to good buckball is just having fun. That's right. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. It's a Ponyville thing. Wow! There's another great episode to add to the list. We have a new sport introduced, have some fun time with Pinky and Fluttershy, and even give Snails a major role. I wasn't expecting to see him, but it was great that he got to share in the spotlight for a change. Pinky being a natural at Buckball felt like a given to me, with all those fancy kicks and head and butt bouncing. But seeing Fluttershy at work with all those saves, holy crap! That tail's practically a weapon! I'm so proud of her for even taking part in something like this. She's really come a long way. We all know how competitive Applejack and Rainbow Dash are. The thrill of the sport and the prospect of victory, those are the things that get their blood pumping. Unfortunately, they didn't realize that that doesn't work for Pinky and Fluttershy, who are as good as they are because they're focusing on having fun instead of winning. So when they started to put the pressure on, things started to fall apart pretty quickly, resulting in a pretty freaky breakdown. Thankfully, AJ and Dash were able to realize their mistake and set things right, by helping them get back into their groove just in time to score a win for Ponyville. I knew they could pull it off. I might not be the sports type, but the lesson applies well to any kind of game, really. Don't let the pressure of winning or losing ruin your experience. Just focus on having fun doing it. Even those hoping you win just want you to do your best and enjoy yourself. A fun, enjoyable episode, all in all. Until next time, see ya!